Right, this is a follow up to yesterday's video really of the very fast speed of this pulse motor with series connected multi strand coils. As you can see, today I've added a third one. It's uh, quite battered up now, but it still works. It's the 10 strand coil. Uh, and what I'll do is I'll show it on the wall adapter being powered for comparison to yesterday and then on that uh, house phone battery there. That's 3.6 volts NICAD. A 400 milliamp one. So, here we are, we'll start it up. As you can tell, that's even quicker. Um, lots of power still. That's just a coil with the red LED on the back. Now where things get interesting is when I ta try to take a milliamp reading. If you listen to the rotor it actually speeds up. And back down again. And there we are with the milliamps. And release. So it speeds up under that load. Uh, it would seem so. So there we are. That's that part, and now I'll show it running on the battery. Okay, the battery is now connected. I say it's 3.6 volts NICAD from a house phone. Here's the other connecting wire that used to connect to the wall adapter. Off we go. A little bit quicker actually, I think. That's scary quick. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching. I must just add this. Um, I thought I'd try a bit of coil shorting. So I put the two wires across there and a little 6 volt bulb. And uh, instead of doing anything interesting electronically, it, uh, it actually sounds more like a Formula One car. So I'll, uh, hang on a second, I'll just start it up. How about that? Thanks for watching.